Hello, this is Right Now. That's Bobby. I'm Heidi, and we are cousins who read books. And this week, Bobby read. What did you read? Uh, I read two books because I was so mad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say. Ah, anger reading. Anger reading. I was quite upset. I, while I was on the internet, you know, you're looking through the Instagram or the Facebook or whatever, and I came across this thing that was this little tidbit about a pirate, a lady pirate. An Irish lady pirate. Mm -hmm. Let me just put that the whole way backwards. Um, Grace O'Malley, right? And I was like, oh, freaking sick. Cool. History. There's you know a what? musical about her. Is there? Yeah, it's called Pirate Queen. It's real good. Oh, that's... Oh, I want to... That... I want to listen to that. Oh, yeah. It's... It's... Um, we... It's a show I worked on, and it was... I wish I had a recording of our cast. <laughs> Did you do it at Hale? I, yeah, it was, it, it was back when uh, Hale was in West Valley, and it was... Um, it was stellar. But, yeah. like, we rented some of the costumes from the original oh, yeah. Broadway production, <gasps> and they had to, like, sign away an arm and a leg. <laughs> That's the one where, um... Yeah. Did I tell you about this time that I bled on a Broadway dress? Oh, yeah. It's that one. Okay. It was the... It was one of the Queen Elizabeth dresses, and <gasps> oh, it was... Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. And it was a white one, and I got blood on it, because, um, they wanted to be authentic, so instead of a zipper, they had hooks up the back. Right, right. And they were sharp. Did you get but, it out? I can't remember. Yeah, I did. Okay, good. I mean, yeah. Because I was like, that's how you die. Yeah, it is. But uh, if you ever get blood on stuff, um, spit, and then um, hydrogen peroxide. I was going to say, wasn't it vinegar, but hydrogen peroxide. No, hydrogen, okay, like, that's right. I, if I'm going to, like, because you get blood on your clothes. Mm -hmm. If I'm, I prefer to, like, start with spit and get as much as I can out with spit, because there's something to do with, like, in your spit there are protein things that break down oh, protein or something yeah and but you can use hydrogen peroxide but it's harsher on the fabric mm. so if it's something that you care it's about you on want everything it, I yeah <laughs> and so if it's something that you want to last long term i yeah. i try only to use peroxide when i absolutely have to yeah that's fair like on like deep makeup stains or True. you know something like that but yeah, yeah. But it was a it's a really good show. Grace o I'm Grace O'Malley just kicks butt in that show. It's so good. She sounds amazing. So that's she why is amazing. This. So I went onto my little Libby app and was like Grace O'Malley, and they're like, "Here's these books." And I was like, "Sick, nice." So I got it, and it is not. It is not <laughs> any sort of thing. It she is gets, not. No, she doesn't kick butt. No. What? Okay, let me tell you. So basically, <laughs> the freaking thing is that. Uh, it starts off with basically there's a grandma and she has a daughter and they're in Ireland and the mom's like, the grandma's like, P.S. we're magical. And the mom's like, I don't want to deal with this. So she moves. No, she gets kind of like married to this dude. They end up, get, she ends up getting pregnant. They end up splitting up. They move to America. She has the daughter. The daughter's just living her life and doesn't realize that she's magic. And then the grandma sends her this book and is like, P.S. you should come on over, um, Here's your stuff. But they think the grandma's dead. So she's like, Mom, I think I need to go over. And she's like, mm, don't. And then she's like, mm, I'm gonna. And so <laughs> sounds like Halloween Town. Yeah. Just, yeah, yeah. Yeah, really. Okay. But I'd rather watch Halloween Town, which I like. But anyway, so <laughs> she ends up going over there and she goes into the house and the grandma's like, oh, I'm alive. And she's like, oh, oh, frick. Well, hey. how did she think she was getting mail from the dead grandma? I don't know. I don't have Heaven has idea. UPS now. I guess so. I, like, I don't have any idea what she thought, but it was just like, ah, oh, you're alive. And then she gets there and basically she gets told, hey, um, the town thinks we're witches and they hate us. But also... Well, if you're the magic, then you are the witches. Yeah. And so, but really everyone just, um, they say they hate us and treat us like garbage, but we're actually buddies with everyone. So I don't really know what that's about. So, because when she gets into town, there's this dude and she had bought a truck, I guess, online. So, because she was like, I'm going to live here for a summer and bought a truck and it wasn't working and this dude came out of wherever to help her for some reason sees her and is like oh frick you're the girl i've been seeing in my dreams for the last like who knows how long and then treats her like garbage wee, wee, i know wee, yeah wee, wee, treats her like garbage and then helps her truck and then she's just like well f you and then leaves right so they're going along and she's like the grandma's like oh yeah so um you can heal people and that's your magic power and she's like oh frick so she kind of, like, learns how to heal people and stuff and whatever. Anyways, so basically, this is what I'm mad about. <laughs> Multiple things. Let's start off with the, if, I don't know, I don't read romance books. But if this is how they go, 
it's upsetting because <laughs> they are abusive and like it's just so weird oh, like you're he... not into like the enemies to lovers no yeah it's me neither just like freaking he's super rude to her and it's just like garbage and then suddenly they kiss and then they push each other away and then p.s there are things i fast forwarded through because it was that sort of book <laughs> and which yeah a spicy book I, a spicy book which i did not i should have freaking this is again another one i'm gonna start reading through the things because yeah you whatever. should probably check the synopsis i really should so I was just excited about a pirate and a girl Irish pirate. Okay, that just seemed the combo seemed great. It it is a good combo if it's yeah I'm if it was, mu- the it musicals is, good. Yeah, well I'll do that then. Yep. But so that's one is K. Okay. So second of all, the how the magic works, right? They say that this Grace O'Malley pirate is magical. That's why she parked her boat and died here in this cove. And so basically, it follows her lineage down right so she had a daughter she was magic and it only follows women so it goes down to yeah. the daughter and it goes Who down the world oh my <laughs> and uh <laughs> so then basically that's why the grandma the grandma got magic the daughter of the grandma has magic yeah the, the daughter the great the, the granddaughter has magic right so here's the thing though in the book come to find out that the da- the mom and dad split the dad got remarried to a lady and had um twin kids I can't remember if they're twins or not, but it doesn't matter. She has a boy and a girl. Well, surprise, the girl has magic. Yeah, but that's if she's, not how if it she's works. not directly descended, that's not how it works. Exactly. You don't you don't catch magic. No. It's not you like don't. that's not how it works. So unless he married, the girl he married ends up being also. So is that dude just being like, I'll just take your cousin and your sister or whoever you guys are? I you know I, mean, I mean, unless she's another relative. Mm-hmm. Or it, magic is like an STD and you can catch exactly. it. Exactly. I no, that's not right? how that works. And so then there's a cousin to that sister, the stepsister, and she mm-hmm. has magic. It doesn't work like that. It no. literally is. so unless this whole town, city, whatever, is just basically incest somehow and, like, in there, descendants and all, of and they're yeah. all descendants of Grace O'Malley, yeah. then and that's they're not all how just it works. whatever. Yeah, exactly. And all of them have different powers. So the one girl the stepsister, she can see auras and whatever, and she can see that sort of stuff. And then the the cousin to the sister, the whatever, she can read minds and whatever, and that sort of stuff. Which, fine, 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 that would be cool, but it's not. And, because <laughs> it just made me mad. And so, basically, I go through this book, right? The only, this is why I read two of them, because there's multiple. There's, I thought there was only six, but I guess there's different chunks of it. And there's like 12 and two halves of these books. So I'm like, where are you going? Two halves? There, there's like a pre and then oh, there's an 11.5. I see. I don't have media. So they're like, and then the other girl, I, I listened to the second book because at the end of the first book, spoilers, um, the girl gets married to the guy that was like, rude to her yeah to because right. and because uh, i don't i don't get enemies to lovers i, I mean i maybe do, i've just never this extreme where I've, they're... maybe i've just never read a book where it was done well yeah. i just i always we hate each other but now we love each other because love and hate no right like they get into a situation where she almost dies and i feel like that's the thing to make them be like actually i might like you sort of situation where mm. she kind of is like well you're really hot so i kind of yeah. like it but i, I mean i can you. i could understand yeah. like oh i'm in um denial of my feelings right. kind of thing right but no that doesn't give you an excuse to be a jerk yeah i don't no, i don't, I don't get that like you but you see that though yeah you know and and then i feel like parents like we push that on the kids it's like oh he pulls your hair because he likes you and it's like well, no, no i think he pulls my hair because he's a a wiener boy a dirt bag yeah um yeah so basically they end up like going on a date and he falls off a cliff and breaks the spoilers oh, no. he breaks his <laughs> leg and she ends up healing his leg which ends up killing her basically because she didn't pull you're supposed to use the magic and then put it out to somewhere into a rock or a tree or something and she didn't do that so the he like hurry and runs her down the hill and she has this moment where she is looking down upon them and, like, sees this whole thing. And Grace O'Malley comes to her and goes, if you don't tell Billy here um, that you have the Magicka, then you will die. You And so I'm going to put you back in your body. And if you don't tell him within 24 hours, I'm just going to yank it back out of you. And you'll die. 
Okay, so now Grace O'Malley also has the power over life and death. Yeah, so... She's the Grim Reaper? I guess so. Or the Virgin Mary? Something. Or something? Uh, yeah, she will... You'll just die. And I don't know how she'll do it, but basically you'll die. So she's all like, eh, he's not gonna like me if I tell him my magic. I'm like, he do just snapped his leg back in and saved him and then he ran down the hill yeah i You're kind of already I there think, and if he wants i to, think the cat like, is out of the bag yeah it's too late anyway so that happens but also p.s my third thing that i was like it's just a bonus like Ew. was they were telling about how grace o'malley the night that she died that the her daughter had her baby had her baby mm-hmm. right so basically it set the timeline was that grace o'malley died they burned her body and set it out to sea right Cool. They then, she has her baby, okay? Or she doesn't have her baby. She then swims back out and scoops up with this chalice, because there's apparently this chalice that everyone's after, scoops up her ashes with this chalice, either pregnant or just had a baby, which is crazy because then you'd be like, oh, sorry, baby, I'm just going to leave you in the sand right here. <laughs> also, my um, business is wide open, and I'm going to swim in the ocean. Oh, yeah, that's how you get sexes. Um, that's icky, and I'm going to scoop up this stuff. And then I'm going to go back to the beach with my mom's ashes and either then have the baby or scoop my baby up. And then I'm going to go back and live like a nor- I Nothing happened. I was like, whoa, that's crazy. Or I don't understand what's happening. But I remember listening to it and being like, that's it. If I had the choice, <laughs> I'd rather swim out there pregnant. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, for sure. I'm not going to swim out there after I'm like after, open. After I'll all say. that. Yeah. So basically, that's it. I'm... Plus... Yeah. Do human ashes float? No, they put it... I think she, like, burned them in a boat or something, and then she, like, scooped it up. I don't know. I don't... They weren't specific on that. But if the boat's that. on... F- I, I don't know, dude. I don't I know. I just always imagined when you do the Viking funeral, oh, yeah, like, the you burn string. and the boat burns, yep. and then you all just sort of sink to the bottom, yep, and that's... Yep. I, I don't know, man. I, I don't... But I... You know, she, I'm not a scientist. I, yeah. Um, maybe if we have, like, any undertakers who listen, they can, like, <laughs> hey, do human ashes float? Could you imagine she's, I like, in the ocean? It. I guess you could. Yeah, but hang on. But, anyways, uh, I looked into other people's reviews to maybe think that maybe I was just having a bad day or something. There was quite a few people that were, like, I started reading this and I got to 5% and there was just too much drama or couldn't, didn't keep my interest, whatever, about it. So if you're just, like, I don't know, if you're into just blip blop whatever again there is scenes in which i don't know how far they get i fast forwarded <laughs> okay. it. it got enough that i was like whoa 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 that's too much like okay so, so I, I googled yes. it says human ashes can float both float and sink depending on the circumstances so some lighter components of the ash can float okay for a short time and i don't even know if she needed the ashes for anything oh so she just went out and got she just some went and got some i don't know i don't know I well, don't know. Maybe well, I, I you, blind angrily didn't remember that part. If, I don't know. If you're going to keep somebody's ashes, you might as well just burn them on the shore. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You're right. You could have been watching your mom burn while you plopped out a baby. I don't know. I, I, so, okay. I don't know. There's my there's my thing. I'm going to I'm gonna listen to but a little bit But other people more. didn't like it. They didn't like it either. There were some people that were like, this is so nice. And I'm like, I think you're a plant. <laughs> mm-hmm. So, anyways, that's... I'm going to... I'm... The, my last few books, I've just been, like, going by the seat of my pants and just being like, ooh, and then it was like, oh, frick. Hmm. So, um, my next ones will be better. <laughs> Sorry that I angry read a lot. <laughs> it feels like. No, Grace O'Malley but... is, she's a fascinating human. No, exactly. That's why I was so excited. I read the little tidbit and was like, bro, yes. And then I got here and was like, bro, that is no. not how it is. Have a good day. No. No, like, I would love to be able to work that musical again, because yeah. it was so good. Maybe like, you should recommend it for the next next year that you do, for years. I well, think. it's... The thing is, it's difficult to do a time period show. Yeah. Although, I mean, it's Shakespearean. We do have some of those costumes. You can, can you rent. not... I was going to say, can you not a- adapt it to something else? But that would eh, also be hard, too. No, like, just be not like, oh, really. Go. Plus, it's, like, you want it to be... You yeah. want it to be how it be. It's I mean, it's good. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways. Um, I so spent out of a 10, lot of time chasing those dresses. Those I don't recommend. Dresses. Okay. Yeah. Anyways. No, like yeah. two or three out of ten? or No. <laughs> zero. I say zero. And if you go ahead and read it anyways, please let me know in the comments what you think about it. Um, I don't know. I don't have any idea. I was going to say maybe the author would be better somewhere else in a different book series, but I, I'm not going to even go down that path. 
So, not for me. Um, yeah. Okay, that's all I have. All right, bye everyone. Okay, bye. Ha <laughs> ha.